Reverie Knights Tactics Prologue. This came to me via an email. Uh, this is the prologue. It's free for anyone to download. It was kind of like a demo, but uh, this came to me via uh, Once the Entertainment mailing list, PR mailing list. And uh, Once the Entertainment works with, I believe, Six Eyes uh, developers and or Six Eyes Studios, maybe. Uh, but, anyways, they uh, are the creators of one of my favorite turn based games, Fell Seal. Um, and the game, this game had kind of that same saturation. It kind of had like you know there was a there's a female protagonist. Uh, uh, the just some of the character designs and everything made me feel like oh it's kind of the same vibe as Fel Seal. You know I love Fel Seal so much. Maybe this would be like you know 2.0 or something like a spiritual successor in terms of like graphics and just delivery and everything. And it is very different. Uh, when I got in and I started playing it, uh, the first thing I noticed was there's like a lot of dialogue. It was a lot of dialogue. There's even a uh, th there's even an alignment system. You have chaos and order. It's your your renegade and paragon. It's your 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 bad girl or your nice girl. You know there's the, the, there's there's two sides of some of the dialogue. Two things you could do. And what happens is later on in the story, characters will reference this time that you partied at night or something. And they're like, yeah, you know, you pushed up when you partied, ha ha ha. And I was just like, okay, cool. Like, you knew about that word? Okay. <laughs> like, all right. <laughs> so, this is your this is your character map here. Uh, or sorry, your world map. Uh, what we're going to do right now, because one of my characters is is hurting for, for health, uh, is we're going to go back to camp and see if we can't heal. Let me see. Let's talk to her. So this is that Garlos. I'm glad you found it. It's hard to feed me during the trip here. So there's a lot. I'm not going to necessarily read all this. I'll let you guys read it if you want to. Um, but just you'll get an idea here of uh, how some of the dialogue works and how much of the dialogue there are. So here it is right here. Uh, or there is. See, wait, uh, what are you talking about? That'd be quite a horror, quite a horror story. Now, that, that doesn't have anything to do with your alignment. Whenever your alignment thing comes up, uh, then it's going to pop up with a little yin-yang looking thing that's red and blue. Um, okay, so she still has something she wants to talk about. Okay. What do you want now? So what's our next step again? We'll need rendezvous with the guide. Okay, cool. I'm wandering aimlessly. Okay, cool. Rendezvous with the guide. Okay. All right. I think I know who that is. All right. Gosh, she has more. <laughs> I'm, I'm hungry. Okay. It's Carlos. Okay. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, yep. Yeah, yep. Yeah, yep. Yeah. Okay. This is a conspiracy. Okay. No more. Okay. Cool. We did it. We did it. Carlos. Carlos is the chef. Uh, I don't know if there's anything for him to that he can uh, do for me. Let me see. I have. Yeah. I have no health here, so I have to eat something. I have to. Let me see. Let's go to items. Potion. No, you need to get food. Muffin. Full your service health. Okay, perfect. And then you. Beautiful. Focus. I have 61 focus. Something to note that you're, um, if you look on the left-hand side there, um, the character's uh, stats carry over. So not like, your, you know, your XP, of course, will continue to carry over as you go from battle to battle, but also your health uh, and your focus will carry over too. So I had like two health. If we went to that next fight, guess what? Probably going to die. Uh, here you can also assign points once you earn them through leveling uh, and then you can do that for, for either character I have one going to finesse one going to defense. There's not there's only like 10 slots So it's not like there's a whole lot uh, that you get. I don't see like um, Tears or anything uh, Where as you're basically as you're uh, moving down you unlock like your fourth ability is now you unlock this this you know, thing or whatever, something to get a huge bonus to your stats or something. Nothing like that. Upper left corner, you can see I am neutral right now. I've only done a handful of, uh, of things. I think I've picked chaos and then uh, order. So I kind of like, you know, split down the middle. Um, here in equipment, you could go through and you can put things on. So this is a tome to give to advanced students. Okay. Advanced students. We're going to go ahead and get, oh, she already has it actually. So can I want, can I put, do I get two of them? Oh, already equipped on the right hand side there. Yep. Learn to read. Uh, over here, the skills this is where you could go through it and put some skills on your bar. You'll see the bar when we get inside. Um, um, and that's it. Oh, you know what? One thing that really bothers me about this game is it's such a it's such a little thing, but it's just it just makes me it makes it makes it feel a little bit forced here. Um, is that this is a like medieval high fantasy game? We have like elves and monsters and all that stuff and magic and everything, right? Uh, and she has a solid black blocky eyeglass frames on. Like that's. That, and she's constantly touching in every single shot, like she's pointing at them and she's saying, look at these things that don't quite fit with the surroundings, but I have them and I need you to know that I'm wearing them at all times. It's just, it's just jarring that your main character is wearing fucking glasses and everything else. He's got string attached to the poles of his shelves 
to hold them up. It's twine. It's probably vine pulled from a tree or something. <sighs> what was I doing here? Uh, let's see. Road. Reach. Yeah, reach. Yeah, reach to that other place. Cool. All right. Let's back out here. <laughs> it's just it hurts my feelings. Uh, all right. So I have full health. Let's go ahead and save. We'll save here. Save. Yep. Good. Good, good, good. Save successful. Awesome. Uh, let's go ahead and head back to world map. Then we're going to go to our next fight. Now, one thing that sucks is, like, I, these are other fights that I've done. Only a handful. I think there's some ambushes in the middle, too. Um, but you can't repeat them. Not not that I see. Maybe in the full game or something, you can go back and repeat them. But in this prologue, it, it kind of just makes you move from point to point. Um... There you go. Let me eating me alive. So we have more dialogue here. You know what's funny? Uh, when I went to go pull this up on Steam, I noticed it's, I noticed uh, underneath like the the right hand column or something like that, uh, towards the middle, it said this is this game has been filtered from your search preferences because of the following tag, visual novel. So it's actually listed as a visual novel on Steam, uh, which is hilarious because yes, I have visual novels filtered because they make there's like 500 of them a day <laughs> and I, I just can't know it's, it's got it's, it's, and so uh the fact that i you know i noticed before i was like there's a lot of words in this like this is a lot of she's touching her glasses you see that everything she's got to touch her glasses uh oh here we go introduce yourself threat us threaten him okay we go chaos oh man the dark side given to them anyways this is definitely a visual novel there's so it's it's so wordy <laughs> <laughs> oh, she's touching her glasses again. All right, let's get into this. Let's get into this fight here. <laughs> I was smashing the button so hard I knocked the battery pack off my fucking controller. Uh, all right, this explains the aggro thing. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and set up initial your initial setup. You could basically position your your heroes wherever you want. So if you want her here, here, her as well, wherever you want to set them up. All right. Um, tactically, that looks that's kind of great. Uh, actually, maybe we should go over here and do this. Hold on a second. Maybe we should not. Oops. <laughs> Uh, all right, well, we started the battle. I was thinking maybe I should go over here and like pick off these guys one at a time. I've already stepped into this thing once, um, and then realized, you know what? We should start recording. Oh, we have a chest over here. Let's go over there and see that. Uh, we can actually move pretty far and still be sheltered. Let's do this. We'll go move her over here, and she's gonna walk very slowly. Uh huh. Uh huh. Yep. And then you just need to stay the face, and that's fine. And then we'll have her come up. Maybe she could sneak up on him or something like that. Hmm, no, she should just stay right next to her. Uh, no, let's do this. We'll try to split it up because the the plant that's right in front of um, uh, the blue haired character uh, is you break it and it drops something, right? So we'll drop like a material or something like that that we could use. So slow. Did I mention already that the animations were slow? Okay, so. The animations are slow. I actually have gotten up. Like, I have like four or five hours played in this. Uh, and that's not true. I actually got up and several times and went and did other things because I was so tired of waiting for my turn to come around. <laughs> I just got bored and got up and left. I had other things to do. All right, let's see. Let's go ahead and select this thing. We'll give it a slap. Oh, uh, let's slap it with this. Oh, actually, yeah, let's with this. Berry, ooh. Okay, we'll go here. We'll just beat this dude up. I'm pretty sure we can beat this guy up. Let's get a little closer. Um, if I select grants an item on the first thing. Oh, you have to step on this tile. Okay, hold on a second. I can still step. There we go. Potion. Cool. That's actually not bad. So we'll go ahead and hold that there. This is great because I believe I'll be able to do a team-based attack here. Oh, he's not gonna get close enough. Uh, if I can maneuver my character. Ooh, you get closer, buddy. Oh, this is gonna be awesome. Can I get another one? Okay, you went too far. Wow, you went really far. Wow, those guys can really move. Yeah, I still want that guy to get too close. Let's see. Now, I've read this game is challenging, and I'm kind of wondering, it's like, because I just kind of, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to 4D chest this, and it's like, it's not looking good right now. Um, I have to really hope that I get some solid, solid, solid combos on some of these characters, or at least I'm gonna think, I might actually hang out in this area and let them lure them to me. Look how slow she freaking walks! Okay, then we're gonna go ahead and whip. Then, let me see. Can 
I swap and then do an attack one and then one. Yes, I can. That was awesome. The anime, I love the animation. I mean, I think the animations are sick. I love those things. Man, they're so good. Let me see a little closer on some of these. Uh, yeah, it's, it's like they did a great job with this. I just, man, I'm just not a fan of how slow it, everything moves in between. Uh, no, no, like, 1.5x movement slash, you know, animation slider or something, uh, which is available in a lot of games. Uh, just, this is, this is what it is. <laughs> like, this is what you get. Now, upper right corner, you see we have, XO. We have bonus XP if we perform those tasks. Uh, I could, yeah, this is looking really bad. Really, really bad. Because they're just going to line up. Uh, and this guy is also coming. I was hoping I could use his choke point as a means to, to protect myself here. Um, I wonder if I can. You know what? Can she walk past? She can. We could do this. And then... Hmm. I'll finish this guy off. I'm just trying to wonder if I should if, I, if there's like another move I could swap with somebody or something, but nah. Nope. I'll kill this guy. Watch our guard here. She can. Uh that's not gonna work. Disability will do eight damage to all enemies. No, one, one tile's around her. So uh nobody is adjacent to me, so it's not gonna work. Um, let me see. This way. And then we'll defend that. There's gonna be some ranged characters coming through. Can they shoot through the wall? Mm, I guess that counts. They got cover there. Huh. What up, boy? You know that there was a guy. Come here. Come here. What, are you gonna tell me some Godzilla thing? No. Okay, what are you, what are you gonna tell me? About what? Did you know that there was a giant war monster from Attack on Titan? <laughs> I did not. Alright, say hi to everybody. Hi! Alright, go on. Love you. <laughs> I did not know that. Um, we're down. We're down here. This is not good. I have a hundred here. Ten damage to all enemies around her, but there's nobody around her. Um, so, gosh, I really get a chance, opportunity to show you guys what the... Hmm, like what, should, what, what they can do with uh, some of the terrain features, like that briar right there. I can knock somebody into that. Uh, but she's done. Like, she is done done. It's not looking good. Um, I'll see if maybe just getting some distance and then just turning around and just watching my back will help. There's no opportunity, uh, by the way, so you can position yourself around a character um, any which way you want and just uh, uh, not have to worry about them retaliating when you walk by or anything like that. An opportunity or a backstab, whatever your game might call it. Oh man, hurry up, go faster. <laughs> just gonna... There's so many enemies. There's so many. And the only thing I can do is pause. I don't think I can do pause. I can't do anything else. I can't zoom in. I can't move the camera around. Uh, God. <laughs> Hold on a second. Is that really an option to, like, let me see. Uh, nope. Uh, you know, in a lot of games, they make it so that you don't, the camera does not move around with the enemy. Um, so that way you can just uh, leave the camera in one spot or explore the, the map a little bit more. Um, oh, did it, un did it unlock here? Oh, it sure did. It sure did. Oh, never mind. Now it's locked again. Oh, weird. Okay. Yeah, now it's locked again. I wonder if it has something to do with the um, going in and out of the menu. You know, it's a prologue. It could also kind of qualify as a demo, which would make it, uh, you know, that would make it uh, an older build. Maybe more bugs or something. Um, this menu does not seem to work, by the way. I kept trying to come over here to select an item to use, but it does not pop up on a sub-menu for me to do that. So I may not be doing that. I may be doing that incorrectly. Uh, let me see. <clears throat> So this is bad, uh, like I said before, and there really is no good re- You know what? Oh, hold on a second. We're gonna try, try to do a swap um, with you. Then we have focus 100, 10 damage, and we'll see- Whoa, that's far. Here we go. Big one, big range too. It's just gonna be these two guys though. Restrain. Okay. So they can't move, but they're still adjacent to me, so it's not superb. That guy would have got hit with 10 if he was within in, within range. One one more tile over, I believe, and that was the two point two action points. Yep, that's it. So, <laughs> Comedy. 
Ha! You girls pack a mean punch. Your story ends here. Retry or load game. Oh my god. Like, I don't even want to do this. <laughs> let's, no, 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 let's, 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 let's grab, let's grab you, let's grab you ladies, we'll run you, no, 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 you know, I don't know we're gonna do, we're gonna rush right up the middle. Rush right up the middle. You know, I wouldn't have a problem, like, going through and doing this over and over again, purely for the sake of the video and for getting stuff done, but I'll be frank with you, like, the speed of animations and getting things done, I, I could have run this thing three times in just that one match. Just that one match. Isn't that wild? Um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just basically push, I'm gonna push as far and as fast as I can. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and take the heat here if I, if I have to worry about taking some damage. And I'm just gonna work right for the, uh, the elf over there and see if maybe we just down the elf. Cause this is a lot of dudes to deal with. Um, and we don't want to aggro all of them. That's the whole point of showing you the aggro range. Uh, is that you don't want to necessarily aggro all of them, but you want know, to do something. Then they all wake up. So let's see. No, he's not aggro, I don't think. They're just cruising, right? Oh, no, 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 they they know. Yeah, I saw the exclamation marks. I wasn't sure if that was a, a warning or if that was the actual aggro. All right, so he's spending one point on that, one point on what? Oh, one point was on movement, got it. Oh, okay, this guy's gonna rage now. All right, well, we're still, we're still coming at you. Still coming at you. Um... Mm, see. How does this work? Okay. Okay, let's see. Nice. That is significant damage. I don't know if she has a good one. Her earthquake thing. Just take your time, so we take your time. Take your time. Okay, then we'll go ahead and hit this guy here and I'll do all both of them. There it is, right there. Boom. Funny how both their uh, alt attacks are basically the same. <laughs> oh man. 84 degrees in here. But I'm naked, so I promise that my anger, <laughs> my, my dissatisfaction with this game has nothing to do with the temperature. <laughs> Uh, Alright, we made it. We made it to the boss. And what we want to do now is... Let's see. Let's see how... Let's see if we get this... Um, is this where we get the joint thing? There it is. Okay, so it's supposed to be, you're supposed to be adjacent or facing the target. Uh, cool. So now I can show you this. And you can also swap if you want to. At the bottom of there. So I can swap back and forth. But we're going to use this one on this guy. And then we get... Oh, powers combined! Team attack 7. Well, that was kind of wimpy for using up... Basically, yeah, three extra points. Um, let's see if I move, then it's gonna it's gonna do it. Hmm. With a nearby unit, so that's too far. Mm, taunt. Let's try that. She's gonna take a beating though, but still, I love this animation. <laughs> All right, let me wait. There's that chest over there. I guess we're never gonna get those. What was it? Like seeds or berries or something like that? Fruits, berries. Did I mention by the way that that health or uh, crystal? You can step on it, and it'll give you 25% health. So oh, backstab! Dang. Yeah, no opportunity. But yeah, there's backstab. Um. Okay, so we could do another double attack here. It would waste. Let's see, what is hers? I think they're both the same actually. We should just crush this thing. Like seriously, that's gonna let me see. What does it say? Does it project how much damage it's gonna do? It doesn't. We better crush this thing. Here we go. Powers combined. Duh, we didn't crush it. Oh, but she could come back around. What is this? Three damage. How much health does this guy have? He has four. Oh, okay, hold on a second. Five damage here. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful. Five damage. Whap. Uh okay, well, eight damage. Fiend. Perfect. This is good. Wow, this, this, this strategy is actually working out. Because they're taking forever, and I actually don't even know if they... Oh, no, they're aggroed on me now. Or they won't get close enough. I don't see an indicator that says when they're aggroed, you know? Like, 
you know, without the little ZZZ when they're not or something. I don't know. Um, cool. Let's just keep on beating this guy down. Uh, please tell me I can access the items. Nope. Just says, oh my god, it didn't move. <gasps> oh, oh my god. That's a That's a Um, so I hit, I came over here and I hit A button on it twice. And that, because my cursor was already down on the floor, it, it, it activated that instead. Yeah, I don't know why that doesn't, that menu doesn't pop up. I don't know what the deal with that is. Uh, maybe I don't have any usable items in this, um, uh, like it's not like a, like, like a consumable. Like I can't sit here and eat a muffin in the middle of battle, basically. All right, let's see. Uh, let's go ahead and do some kind of range attack here. Six damage, and he's chill. Crit, beautiful. And then, let's see. We're gonna go and position ourselves over here. Then we're gonna see if we can't slap him back a little bit. And then it drops the berry. Awesome. Got uh, hella focus, it looks like. So he's gonna have some special attacks coming up. Mm -hmm. Oh man, perfect. This is good. How funny. I, I tried to take the safe route before, and I saw how quickly it did. You saw how quickly it just fell apart. <laughs> now I'm like, yeah, this is happening. Okay, so she could just sit there and tank. We don't have to do our special attack BS right now. Um, let me see. And this was what happens to damage all layers and one tiles, two tiles away. Yeah, so mm, until that guy moves, we're going to hold off on that one. We have the focus, so we'll just keep on. We'll just toss this over here. Focus down this boss until everything else gets in range. Glanced. Oh, man. Painful. Painful. Okay, well, we'll just keep it up here. Only as well tiles run. Brigadino will wait. Just push him back, which is great because then he has to spend one of his points repositioning himself unless he uses a range attack. One point spent doing... What was that? Oh, okay. <laughs> you know what? If they sped up animations in combat... Well, the combat animations are actually plenty fine, but the movement animation, they sped those things up. I would buy this for my Switch. Just just as it, like, it sucks that I can't, like, re, uh, redo maps, you know, and just, like, farm XP and unlock things and really, like, pump up my character. Because that's what I want to do. I want to min-max with characters, right? Um, let me see here. Hold on a second. Let me see if I can't do some work on this. Without necessarily leaving my, my cozy corner. Oh, this is gonna be good. Yeah. Two action points on this one. Wow. <laughs> oh, sweet. Um, good. Yeah, you just stay there and you just watch your back there. I might actually reposition her to do some uh, some damage because this is only gonna work. Yeah. Or obviously the the tiles is immediately adjacent to her. Um, move over. I can't move over here and retain my points. Uh, oh, you know what? I know what I could do. Oh, wait, can I do this? Oh, damn. Uh, well, you know what? This will kind of work. Let's try this. We're going to swap with this guy. We'll be surrounding him now, uh, which means we'll be able to use our team attack again. And then we're going to use this, which is going to activate yeah, the entire surrounding area. And this will lock him in place, which is not really going to do much for us right now. Couple good stops. Ten! Oh, we're straying. Great, we got rid of one guy there. She's low on health, though. This thing, everything's just notch. Oh, there he goes. Now it's now it's coming. Is he gonna shoot me in the back? Oh god, just poison. It's just poison. It's fine. Oh, oh wait, it's bad. <gasps> oh yeah. Oh no. Well, we're not gonna get that uh thing. <sighs> Snap. Yeah, how much damage? Four damage. Six range and chill. What if I should do a run? Do a, like book it. That restores focus all the way over there. You know what? This might be a good moment to do this. 25% focus. I could throw another freeze at him. Oh, so slow. <laughs> Man, it's like, it's seriously like if I was to rate this like 1 to 10, I, I would just be like, well, that's a minus 9 moment right there. Like the fact that I, I take so long to do anything. That's minus nine points. Oh, God, crit me. <laughs> ha, you girls pack a mean punch. 
Uh, yeah, so that's, um, that's the game. Like, like I said, they get rid of her glasses and, uh, give us a speed slider for the, uh, that, the movement animations. And this game is an easy seven, right? I mean, the, the story, sure, like, whatever, there's some story there. Uh, does that replayability? No, probably not really. Not depending on how they, they want to build out your characters and everything. Uh, and I compare this to Fell Seal, which it has like infinite replayability because there's so many job combinations. So many. This game is not going to be like that. Uh, you're specializing your character down, down like you know, only several paths based off of whatever their, uh, uh, whatever their spell book or whatever uh, unlocks. So, you know, I do, I do like, I do like the animations. The animations are beautiful. They're so good. They're so good. But. Uh, uh, you yeah, know the movement and all, and all that I, I would say this game would be a great $19.99 game But I have a feeling it's gonna be $29.99 um, And that's just based off of what some of the other games that they publish so we'll see my name is Mike the aka phony Thank you so much for watching the game is called Reverie Knights Tactics. This is the prologue. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you guys later